development of the windmill became one of the most important pieces of technology for the settlement of the West. The windmill had been invented many years earlier by the Persians and then used and adapted by the Chinese in 1200 AD. But it wasn't until a man named Halliday invented the one that we see now. Uh, that was in 1854. The use of the windmill allowed people to move into more arid areas, uh, access water where they needed it, and it also allowed them to not only live there, but to raise more livestock, more crops, and to stay where they were. It, it increased the ability for settlements to come in and for people to come in and, and build businesses and establish themselves. The, uh, the site of one of these windmills became the symbol for this settlement. You could see it across the prairies and even up in the mountains when you're traveling. You could see the, where a windmill had been put in. You knew that there was somebody had been there and they just had found a water source. And so it became one of the things that was most important in moving west. The technology that was used to develop and, in, develop and invent the windmill uh, has not changed all that much, but the, it, the predecessor before that was essentially digging a hole till you hit water and getting it out with water uh, with a bucket. So it was the precursor to having these windmills uh, set in place and it allowed people more flexibility, um, a permanence to where they were, and the establishment of population in the West.